Hi guys, Charlotte Sometimes here for Celeb Buzz, talking about The Voice episode um, that was on Monday and Tuesday. Um, one, I just want to say that I'm so proud of all my teammates. I think they did an amazing job. Um, it was nice to see Raylan just get down and dirty and country, and, and I actually quite enjoyed that performance. Um, mm. And, uh, you know, Jermaine, I think he really redeemed himself from you know, the prior episode of doing Living Like a Prayer, I didn't think it was his strongest song. So it was really nice to see him really blossom in this one and uh, do his thing. Though, Jermaine, just stop looking so angry all the time. You're such a happy person, and, and you look like you're going to punch somebody in the face when they talk to you. And, and I think it's your nerves, and, and I love you. And, um, you know, I just don't... I think that you're a lot sweeter than you come across when people are talking to you at the end. Um... Erin, I think she did a great job, but um, I would like to see her do something a little softer. Um, just to show that she can do more than just be the loud girl. And and I think, you know, talking to her while we were part of the show together, um, I think she wants to do that too. So I hope they give her that opportunity. Um, Jordis, um, my hat's off to you. You're amazing, and I wish you so well. I know you're going to kick kick butt, um, you know, in the music world, and this isn't the end for you, and I wish you so well. Christina's team, um, you know, I'm a total man fan, but I actually was quite disappointed with his song choice, but I think that being said, he executed it to his, to the best of his ability, and, um, it was still amazing, um, but I just think that it wasn't, the right song for him, but I don't think he did a bad job or anything like that. I think he was very entertaining and great, and he made it his own. And I'm still a man fan, and um, you know I can't wait to see what he what he has in store for us uh, in two weeks. Um, Ashley De La Rosa, I think she keeps growing, and I think that's just awesome. And she really kicked, you know, the Jewel song. Uh, she kicked its ass, and I'm just so proud of her. And and it's really sad to see her go. But she's only 18, and I think she's going to be just fine. <laughs> um, Lindsay, I think, was actually really good. I think um, it was nice to see her be even more comfortable in her skin on stage. I think her stage presence has really um, shown a lot of growth. Um, I would like to see for um, her next um, live round, I would like to see her not arrange a song and her really just sing um, the song and just kind of show us what she can do vocally, not just with arrangements. I would like to see a little bit more power in her voice and um, just a little bit more authority over the way she sings. And And I really think that we're going to see that from her. I think she has a lot of potential and um, I think she's doing a great job. So, um, oh, and just side note, when she sang her Save Me song and Christina Aguilar started crying, I had to say I had like a bag of cheese puffs and I was just bawling last night and um there's just something about Christina Aguilera that just really I don't know I think she is such a strong ass bitch and I love her and um seeing her tear up was just I don't know it was really moving to me um she's always been really super kind to me on the show and and I and I love her and um I could just tell how how hard it was for her to like make these decisions and she was really moved by by Lindsay's performance, as was I. I think Lindsay did an amazing job, and, and I know how hard it is to be up there, and, and I just want to say you did a great job, and I'm, I'm very proud of you. Um, Jesse got eliminated on, on Monday night. I know that caused some controversy, but I think that um, Christina made the right decision because I think um, Jesse doesn't have as much... Um, he's not as coachable, so she doesn't really have a lot to offer him, and... Um, uh, marketing wise I'm not sure how he would succeed in the music business um but then again I'm not really sure I think he has an amazing voice and he and he does everything um kick butt um but he every performance is kind of the same so I think um maybe that had something to do with her decision and save me song was great she did a great job and I can see why um, Blake saved her, and though I am surprised that um, he did not save Raylin, because uh, I know that it, it's she's kind of his favorite. It was nice to see her do something a little bit softer. I actually um, think that it was one of my favorite performances 
of hers because we got to see that she can actually sing too and and there's like little subtleties in her voice that really just moved me and um it was more grown up and um it's just my personal taste so i i actually quite enjoyed it and um i think i understand why blake chose Aaron and I normally wouldn't say that I would pick Raylan um cuz she's not really um it's not really my thing but um I think I would have saved her cuz I just think um her performance moved me more um and uh yeah it was really tough really tough to see Ashley go really tough to see Raylan go Christina crying was probably the highlight of the show cuz I think people don't get to see that she is a sensitive wonderful woman and um being raised the way that she was raised in this industry and um, I think she just standoffish and she knows who she is and I think a lot of people confuse that with cockiness and I think she's just a confident confident woman and I dig that and um it was really tough to see her break down it like made me I don't know why it just made me made me ball so um anyway I, I also love the group performances though I think Blake's was a little cheesy, and, and I love you, Blake, I love you so much, but um, it just kind of reminded me of like a high school yearbook thing, um, but I thought Christina's fighter was amazing as well, um, I thought it was hilarious when she was throwing the dollar bills at uh, Blake, um, but you know, uh, I think it was a great two episodes, and I'm so, so, so excited to see Team CeeLo and Team Adam next week, and uh, stay tuned for all my opinions, whether you like them or not, <laughs> bye guys.